Hello everyone and welcome, my name is Andrew Can, to the We Can Game. In the last episode of Can Play Portal 2, we made our way through Old Aperture. We learned that GLaDOS is most likely Caroline Johnson, or just Caroline, not really sure if they were married. Good to assume that they were. However, we're going to move forward and GLaDOS For gave God's us an sake, idea. your boxes with legs! It's, it's literally your only purpose, walking onto buttons. How can you not do the one thing you're designed for? Oh my god. But GLaDOS gave us the idea how to beat Wheatley. We have to put him in a paradox situation. So... Try to get us down there. Oh my god! Warmer. Warmer. Boiling hot. Boil... Okay, colder. Colder. Ice cold. You're arctic now. It's, you're, you're very cold. <laughs> very, 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 very cold. Look, just get on the button! Oh my god, what is this oh, weird... Oh, it's funny, is it? Oh, it's funny, because we've been in this for 12 hours, and you haven't solved it either, so I don't know why you're laughing. Oh my god! I love this. Hour. They look like hermit crabs. Look at this. I wonder. Wow. I'm guessing we're gonna go in there. Oh wait, we can't go in there that way. Unless. Ah, I was right. We can go in there. That's really funny, actually. Oh my god. I find it pretty hilarious. Hermit crab turrets. What even? No, Wheatley is probably smart enough to know we're here. Well, he should be, at least with all that intelligence he got. He has, so... I guess we're gonna have to help him out with the Hermit Turrets. I'll call them, whatever their official name is. I'm sure you will let me know. Oh my gosh. Look at these things! <laughs> yes! I knew you'd solve it! Oh. Hello? Um, true. I'll go true. Yeah, that was easy. I'll wow! Guess. I might have heard that one before though. Sort of cheating. It's a paradox. There is no answer. Look, this place is going to blow up if I don't get back in my boat. Uh, false. I'll go false. Oh my gosh! Hold on. I thought I'd fix that. Warning. Reactor core is at critical point. There, fixed. Hey, it is great seeing you guys again. Seriously, um, it turns out I'm a little bit short on test subjects right now, so this works out perfect. Oh my god. And off we go. I love how he put Wheatley on the back, and... Wow. Just, just, just these things are killing me. Oh, he, he murdered them. Oh well, I like how he'd want, he's in no denial. I have no idea what it's like in this body. I have to test all the time. Or I get this, this itch, you know? It must be hardwired into the system or something. Oh, but I'll tell you, when I do test, oh, oh man alive, nothing feels better. It's just, I've just that's why I've got to test. That's why I've got to test. Oh my god. So, you're going to test, and I'm going to watch. And everything is going to be just fine. Morning. Core overheating. Nuclear meltdown imminent. Oh wow. We are in trouble. Core is melting down and Wheatley just wants to test. It's like an addiction almost, I guess. Oh no, it is an addiction. Test chamber one. Test. Design this test myself. It's a little bit difficult. You'll notice the moat area there. Very deadly. Extremely dangerous. Eventually. It's uh, not at the moment, but we'll... Uh, Oh, yes. Oh, well done. Wow. Oh, that's tremendous. I have a feeling it won't be that easy. Oh, that felt really good. Oh, here's an idea. Since making tests is so difficult, why don't you just keep solving this test? So what? And I can just, like, watch you solve it. Yeah, that, that sounds much easier. Oh, God, we're in a paradox of testing. The irony! It's an endless loop of the same test, isn't it? Here we go. Now, do it again. I'm sure there's a reason that's up there. Come on, you've already solved it. Come on, you've already solved it once. Less than a minute ago, you solved this puzzle. Do it again, please. Oh my god. I think that's how we beat him. Maybe we just don't solve the puzzle. One minute ago. Let, let. And... No. 
started. All right, can't blame you for trying. Okay, new tests, new tests. Oh my god, it's the same. Achievement unlocked, Where? dual pit experiment. Oh, here we go. He's created a new test. Please remain calm. So because of how intelligent Wheatley is, intelligent with air quotes, we might be here a while, <laughs> or until a nuclear meltdown, you know, whichever comes first. Probably not. Remember your evacuation training. Yeah, things are not going well. GLaDOS needs to get back in her body, something I never right. thought I'd say. Everything's good, I just invented some more tests. Not entirely, not entirely. Look at the word test there on the wall. That's brand new. Where up oh, that actually is brand new. So that just essentially lifts us. Is there a way to get over there? Perhaps. I see now what I have to do. I have to let this slip. Alright, gotta rise up. Or not. Wait, I understand it. My bad. Kinda dumb. Forgive me. That's much better. Okay. Let's get the hermit turret. Favorite kind of turret is the hermit turret. Like, look at that! It's trying to get away. How cute and sad at once. I want to read what it says there. Oh my god, that's where the ammunition went. Look at how scared it looks. What are your thoughts of the design on the hermit turret, as I've been calling it? I kind of find it hilarious. Okay, so I know that there will be something there. Up, oh, hermit turret trying to get away, isn't he? No, he's not. <laughs> look at him. Look <laughs> how scared it is! Oh, wow. <laughs> well done. Seriously, both of you. Why don't, I, why don't you two go on ahead, yeah? I'll just, I'll catch up with you. How do we go on ahead? I guess we have to go up here again. It's, it's just, it's like, he's just so into it. It's kind of creepy. It's essentially, he's getting off on it, that's, that's for sure. Oh my god! Oh god, thanks GLaDOS. But to be fair, yeah, we've done made this test myself out of smaller tests that I found lying around. Jammed them all together. Buttons, got funnels, bottomless pits are involved. It's got it all. It's got it all. Absolute dynamite. It's got everything. So now... I've created a paradox situation, haven't I? I'm gonna have to go back to this one. It's weird, I don't know how else to describe what's going on. Oh, I see what I have to do. I have to hit that on the wall, then it'll take me over. Got it. Okay, please make it through. Now, I'll switch to blue. Switch to all right, okay, this is taking too long. Blue. Okay, I'll just tell you how to solve the test, okay? See that button over there, all right? You just need to... That's why I can't help you solve the test. What's... Uh, uh, uh. Never mind. Never mind. Solve it yourself. You're on your own. Wow. Okay, well... That will come over here eventually, because it's got a move to there which I can switch to here which I will then put here switch the blue there oh, yes. there well, we go uh, that was pretty easy right oh my gosh GLaDOS still evil to the end. I love how this kind of looks like an aperture ring. I just wanted to point that out. 
Let's continue onward. Let's try to beat Wheatley. Aperture Laboratories. Wheat. Oh my god! <laughs> Oh wow. I'm coming, coming, don't start yet, don't start yet. You are not gonna believe this. I found a sealed off wing. Hundreds, hundreds of perfectly good test chambers just sitting there, filled with skeletons, shook them out, good as new. Oh god! Look at the facility just crumbling. Oh god. Um. Can't even tell, can you? Seamless. Seamless. Wouldn't go that far, but uh, you know, whatever. What makes you happy? I love how Glados did stockpile test. I kind of figured she would have. I mean, just how she is. She's still evil, and I'm not saying that. But I don't. I think I kind of understand why she's evil. She's if she was Caroline forced into a computer, I I don't blame her for. You know, how she is. How would you react? Oh, sorry about that. Be right back. Sorry about that. One of the perks of living next to a train station. So, we just made it over here. I think if I put this here, that should cause the... Oops, I'm a little off. My bad. My bad! Okay. So, from there, I think I can... Alright, there we go. Perfect. So, now that we have the hermit... Hermit turret. Hermit, hermit turret. Why don't I... Looks like if I put it about right there, I should be okay. Okay. Now do I... How do I go from here? Maybe... Can I lift this slightly? Like if I put it... Aha! Maybe if I keep lifting it slowly over time it'll get to a point where if I cancel one of the portals it'll kind of go that way so let's lift it once more as high I can make it high as I can get it to go um wait a minute actually I'm gonna stop doing that one what happens if I Oh, I was like, why can't I move? Okay, what happens if I jump in this? Okay. I think I, I, I literally can... My bad. My bad. There's honest mistakes. Okay, so... Knowing... Oh, it's so helpless on its back. It's so cute in a weird, messed up way. Okay. Okay. Just keep focus, keep focus. Um, okay, I got it. So I will put this on a blue one right here. Then put a blue one right there, or not? Nope, that was just a joke, a really cruel joke. It's kind of funny in a weird, sick way. Okay, so right about here. Nope, my bad. Didn't want that to go through anyway. Now I did. There we go. Perfect. Figured it out. And once that hits, we don't imagine. Actually, how do I get back up there? Yeah, I probably had to. Dang it, I figured it out. Thankfully, the gravity was kind to me. But wait, how would I? It looks like we both have to be in the same stream. And then I switch it over. Ah, that makes more sense. <laughs> Look at him! Here we go. Oh god, look at him! It's so helpless! Figured it out. Oh, disappointed. No, we're not. I think I know what's happening. I think what's happening. I will, but I think I know what's happening. Whatever made GLaDOS so unhappy with testing is happening to Wheatley. I think there's a certain right, so level of enjoyment. The last test was seriously disappointing. Apparently, being civil isn't motivating you, so let's, well, let's try her way, alright? Fatty. Adopted fatty. Fatty, fatty, no parents. What? What exactly is wrong with being adopted? 
What's wrong with being adopted? Uh, uh, well, um, lack of parents. For the record, you are adopted, and that's terrible. And also, with me. nothing. Oh my well, God! Uh, well, some of my best friends actually are orphans. Also, but look at her, you moron. She's not fat. I am not a moron. Just do the test. Just do the test. Whoa, so you can change the polarity of the... Okay, that's awesome. Also, Chell's adopted? <laughs> I did not... I mean, I guess I should have figured, right? But, like, that's still interesting news to me. Like, I had no idea she was adopted. I mean, I guess I really haven't put too much thought in it. Okay, 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 I gotta save that, gotta save it. It's too late. No way to save it. Let's hope it drops another one. Okay, there we go. How do I get that? So, from here, it'll go. And then we put one here makes it hard but it's not impossible because right about now I make one to where to lift me back over there perfect but yeah Chell being adopted that's interesting who are her parents and why is Chell still alive compared to all the other test subjects all these questions and more will I get answers probably not do I care a little bit whoa uh oh Oh, no, 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 no. Wait, do I need to be pushed the other way now? I do. Huh, that required thinking of that. If I'm such a moron, why can't you solve a simple test? I might have pushed that moron thing a little too far this time. Oh, God. And I think the paradox question is, what's wrong with being adopted? But I love how GLaDOS was like, you are adopted and that's terrible. <laughs> God dang. So vicious, even even Potato Glados still has it. Oh, oh no. Oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. I hope that, hope that didn't disturb you too much then. It was the sound of books, pages being turned. So that's uh, just what I was doing, just reading uh, books. So not a moral. Anyway, just finish the last one. Just now the hardest one, Machiavelli. Do not know what all the fuss was about. Understood it perfectly. Have you read that one? Yeah. Yeah, thanked it. Well, on with the test. Wish there was more books. Well, there's not. <laughs> Have you read Machiavelli? Yes. I doubt it. I like how Wheatley's just like, I doubt it. So... I think we're kind of at this weird stasis now. Actually, I plan this right. Let's go down. There we go. That made sense. So where is it gonna fall from, though? I guess we'll have that be our answer. Oh. So now we make it to where, or not? Let's watch this again. Watch the trajectory. Bounces. Oh, I get it. We put one here. That way, when it bounces, it gets stuck up there. So, this way, it's just the same puzzle again. It falls through. Cool. We figured it out. What was that? That was nothing. That was nothing. Maybe you should go back to reading books, Wheatley. They're so terrifyingly cute. Oh my gosh. Wow, so I was right. It does have a built-in euphoric thing that she was able to get past. But Wheatley, I'm not too sure if he'll be able to get past it. Operator warning. Molten core warrior. An operator expectation has exception has occurred. Press any key to vent and radiate. Oh my god. 
Consult reactor core manual for instructions on proper reaction core. Press any key to continue. I kind of find that funny. Don't mind me. Just moving the old test chamber a little bit closer to me. Um, out of thought, maybe proximity to the test solving might give us stronger results. What was that? Oh, sorry, I could have sworn you said something. Oh my gosh. He's taking us right to him. This is perfect. Why I do not disagree. Let's watch. So now, if I put portals here and here, so the problem I see is that this. So I can go over there, but my portals won't stay. Oh god. Yeah, that was bad. That was really bad. Are you still there? We are in a lot of trouble, but you know, we'll always get Don't through it. Just moving the old test chamber a little bit closer to me. Um, out of thought, maybe proximity to the test solving might give us stronger results. What was that? Oh, sorry, I could have sworn you said something. Oh, I see what we have to do now. So once we get that... Okay, I'm starting to solve it. That'll protect us from their turret fire. Okay, it's all making more sense, folks. So let's put this. Get a turret. Termit crab, so I've been calling it. Now, I'll put that light right there. How will I get through? I don't know. Perfect. We've been able to get through. Okay. So from here, I'm sure we just launch ourselves. Bless your little primate brain. I'm not actually in the room with you. I'm like technology. Complicated. Uh, you can't hurt the big old. I did not know face. we could do that. That was an honest mistake. But it's hilarious that we can crack the screen Wheatley's on. Like we don't like him that much. That's a cool little feature they've included. Okay, so that's what it's for. It's to stop us. So now, good. Slowly but surely, I'm understanding the physics of this. Now, I'm thinking with portals. I'm going to start actually thinking a little better with portals here. So now that we're up here, this could go here. Aha! So, they can't fire at me now. Even though I'm sure they'd love to. They can't. Okay, let's make sure this is good and settled down. It's on its back, can't do much are now. You, are you absolutely sure you're solving these correctly? I mean, yes, you solved it, but I'm wondering if... Maybe there's a number of ways to solve them, and you're picking all the worst ways. Oh my god! No, no, that was the solution. Ah, what am I missing? I don't know what you're missing, but hopefully you don't find it. <laughs> I think he's getting desperate. I think so, too. No. Desperation can lead to a lot of terrible things, but that's going to be it for this episode. It's going to be it for today. Let me know. What do you think about Wheatley insulting us, trying to be more like GLaDOS? What do you think about the comment that Chell is adopted? You know, I haven't really thought much about who Chell's parents are, though that is very important. I mean, think about it. Chell, why is she the one that's still here? What makes her different? What makes her special? Also, I love how they always go for the weight. Like, really? What a stereotypical female thing to attack. Chell is not overweight at all, and that just that kills me. But that's going to be it for this episode. It's going to be it for today. Let me know your thoughts and reactions when you went through it. I'm curious. Thank you all so much for watching, and I hope you have a great day.